2018 Han Decree V Review. Who five years ago seemed consigned to the uncool basket, are well and truly reinvigorated and on a roll. First came the HRV, a small SUV that revived the familiar badge from the early 2000s and has become a top seller in its class. Then came the new Civic, Honda's well-known small car came in for a massive overhaul from stodgy to thoroughly modern. Now, it's the CRV's turn. Like HRV and Civic, the 2018 Honda CRV has been entirely rethought, based around a new turbocharged engine, a more refined interior, and a strong value for money pitch. The fifth generation CRV, time built for Australia, arrives with the smartly designed product lineup of four models, spanning the competitive $30,000 to $44,000 price range. Honda are pitching the new CRV as similar in quality, but with more features and therefore stronger value, than an equivalent Mazda CX-5, Volkswagen Tiguan, or Hyundai Tucson. Keyless entry and start, two back seat USB ports, and a digital driver gauges are all standard. But it's the $33,290 of TS that really sucker punches its rivals, upping the specification to include an electric tailgate navigation, and 18-inch wheels. As more than class competitive, a relatively modest 240 newton meters seems like a missed opportunity to make this car a bit more perky and fun. You can feel a decent chassis sitting underneath, even though the CRV shares nothing, platform-wise, with Civic. The CRV is unabashedly a car designed for comfort and family practicality. Honda openly admits it has no sporting pretensions. This is backed up by the CRV's relaxed driving experience, with excellent drive quality, limited cabin noise intrusion, and a few Skoda S clever features, like a handbag swallowing center console, four USB ports, and an easily adjustable power tailgate that reveals a big boot. This is the first seven seat Honda CRV although you only get the extra seats in the second from top TL model, $38,990. Choosing seven seats means foregoing all-wheel drive, and some boot space. But while Honda concedes they are occasional seats, not really large enough for everyday use, a six-foot adult fits and short journeys would be fine. It's about as spacious as the third row in the Skoda Kodiak. Honda are still struggling with advanced safety technology. The fact that Honda Sensing, the company's full suite of safety tech, cannot be split into constituent parts is disappointing. It means that EB is not standard fit on the CRV, it is limited to the flagship $44,290 TLX trim. It's particularly in this regard that the 2018 Honda CRV still trails the CX-5, which has forwards and backwards EB, even in the Bass model.